Group six, and I'm Brenna Sullivan. I'm Gong Nu Lor. I'm Cassie Belanger. For this first step, we're going to work on the imposition for this project. Once we've set up our stock size and our media, then we just need to go over to job create imposition and then type in our specs for the job. Now we just got to do the page numbering. Actually, gonna switch that to. We're gonna want this to be page one and for that to be four for our job. Now I'm just gonna duplicate out these spreads. To our desired page count. And now we're just going to have to drag over the PDF files that are going to be placed on these pages. Navigate to our folder. Going to select all these refined PDFs. Drag them over to Prep 7. Alright, now that they're in Prep 7, we're just going to have to drag them to where they need to go on the layout. So select all of these PDFs that we just drug in here and drag them to their pages. And now we can check and see if they went in the right place. Alright, this looks pretty good. Now we're just going to check the front and back pages to make sure they laid out right. Alright, and those look good. We decided that for our project, we were going to create a cutting program to help us expedite the process. In this video, I'm writing the program and double checking all of my measurements to make sure it aligns with the crop marks that we have on our product. Because we decided to spiral bind, collating was crucial to our ordering for binding later on in this process. This ensured everything would be in order when we were done. For the spiral binding part, we went downstairs to the lab. The hole then I inserted it I in the spiral binder to hole punch it. Then I measured it to ensure that the holes are centered. 